In this video, I will show you how to enable HistaCP PHP MyAdmin. So, if I check the uh, PHP MyAdmin, so PHP MyAdmin is not enabled. Also, here is show existing configuration file etc php myadmin config.inc.php is not readable so today i enable uh, this uh, php myadmin page so let's follow the step it's very easy uh, i use some command just copy and paste so at first i see the documentation so here is here is the documentation i will attach the link below the video description here is the documentation I, I have already tried this code but this code is not work uh, I have my own code so at first I log in on admin panel I use my password here so uh, this is the history admin panel I already log in so uh, and the, this is uh, PHP my admin page now I need to log in the root on this server so I use the Bitwise software Bitwise SSH client so here is I already put my IP and username is root so simply I just click uh, login then I paste my password here so here is uh, showing a uh, new terminal console this is the terminal console uh, the console is clear here is uh, the command process so step by step you follow first I use uh, this command for enable the PHP my admin so I copy the command like this uh, this page is not readable so I paste here then press enter now I reload the PHP my admin page this page is read for access the database i need to uh, create a, a user for create a user i go to my uh, command so here is uh, showing the uh, mysql uh, minus mysql dash a root dash p this is the command i copy again paste here then enter this is my password and again enter see the uh, mariadb is uh, successfully connected now i create a new user i, I copy this command i just change uh, like a username put my password I select a random password here then I copy paste here so here is a uh, show error uh, I'll try to find out the problem don't worry about that I again open this is password You see uh, the row is affected and it's working then I go to the next step so grant a privilege so I copy this uh, line and paste here I just uh, replace on username then again copy paste here again row affected third step flush privilege then last step is exit you see here is a uh, right by so MariaDB is uh, already exit now I try to log in the username and password so this is my username paste here and this is my password See here is uh, showing the all databases and here is also show the user account uh, if you want you can delete and change your mysql account information so this is the master php my admin panel also here is i use uh, username and password all username and password i use tutorial purpose only do not try to use the username and password access to login this database because this thing is not working for you it's working only on your server when you set up your password and your username 